The name Tame Dog comes from a snowboarder's front flip. When you replicate the staggered leg stance that snowboarders have on takeoff and do a front flip, it can be called a Tame Dog. A regular front flip is when both feet take off the jump at the same time. A Tame Dog is often one of your first flips because it can be done low risk, especially in the right soft conditions. Before flipping, be able to spin 360s and 540s with mellow grab. We recommend using trampolines before sending it on snow. With tramp skis on, make sure your front flips are easy. The biggest difference between a front flip and a tame dog is the takeoff and the landing. Start with finishing a front flip with your weaker leg touching the ground before the other, landing forward into your strong leg. Next. Take off into your front flip with your strong leg in front. The more you kick your weak leg back by pushing off your strong leg, the faster you can get it going. To challenge yourself, take off the tramp skis and try some off of a ledge onto a mat. Once that's solid, head out to the mountain. Find yourself a cat track with a moderately steep and soft slope behind it. To ensure that you won't hurt your neck, See if you can lean super far forward on your skis and grab your noses. You'll need that flex to go over your head. Set yourself up on the edge of the cat track. Now lean far forward, tuck your head in like you would for a front roll. Put your hands to the ground and kick your weak leg behind to get rolling to the back of your head. Try to roll from your neck smoothly down to your lower back to reduce impact. When you land on the other side, your tails will most likely get caught in the snow. That's normal at first. As you go faster, your tail should get less caught up after the roll. Slowly start to ski into the cat track. Just before the roll, with staggered legs, lean back on your weak leg and push forward to roll off your strong leg. When you come around flipping, get your weaker leg tucked in to accelerate and to prepare for landing. By now, you should be starting with your arms up instead of reaching straight to the ground to get some power into your stronger, planting foot. Keep going faster and popping slightly before the edge of the cat track until you're landing upright. Get all the way around into your front foot to land stacked and comfortable. If you can do that, trying one on a smaller jump isn't harder, but it does require more confidence since you will be going faster. Planting your foot against the jump takeoff creates more resistance than a cat track does. Therefore, your planting leg should have to work harder, but once it's flipping, it should be easier to land. Be safe with your first flips. Going through the steps and choosing the right conditions to go for it is key. This tutorial was filmed on Whistler Black Film. I'm Dean Burkert from Ski Addiction, helping you ski better.